How to make a fire extinguisher out of kitchen supplies. This is a great way to build your own fire extinguisher using scientific principles and ordinary household items. You will need an 18 ounce mayonnaise jar with a lid, 12 ounces of white vinegar, paper towels, two tablespoons of baking soda, and a rubber band. Optional, a peanut butter jar. Step one, pour the vinegar into the clean, dry, empty mayonnaise jar. You can also use a plastic peanut butter jar. Step two, use a paper towel to dry excess vinegar from the top half of the jar. Step three, loosely hold a clean paper towel over the mouth of the jar and push the center into the jar so that it forms a little cup over the vinegar. Step four, pour the baking soda into the jar so that it falls into the paper towel cup. Step five, slip the rubber band over the mouth of the jar so that it holds the paper towel in place. Step six, Replace the lid on the jar, being careful not to let the vinegar touch the baking soda. Step seven, shake the jar if there's a fire, mixing the vinegar and baking soda. Then point your fire extinguisher at the fire and open the lid. Mixing the vinegar and baking soda will produce carbon dioxide, eliminating oxygen from the fire and extinguishing it. Did you know? In 1884, when the water supply was exhausted and a fire threatened to destroy San Francisco's old mission church, red wine was used to extinguish the flames.